everyone, this is Carla Quinones and welcome to my first ever YouTube video. Um, I am so excited to begin this journey. This is actually one of my New Year's resolutions is to start my own channel. I am currently a high school teacher and I had a lot of students, um, teachers, friends just ask me where I get my clothes, how do I do my makeup, how do I do my hair and I really do love watching YouTube vlogs and beauty vlogs and I was just thinking maybe I can start doing them as well and reach out to my students and my friends and anyone else who's willing to watch and just learn a little bit from someone who really is passionate about fashion and beauty products. And for my first ever video, I wanted to start with my favorite products of 2013. Uh, it's a combination of high-end products as well as drugstore products, so there's a little bit for everybody, and just some lessons that I learned along the way as discovering these products. So let's begin. The first one is the Herbal Essence Shampoo and Conditioner. They just came out with the original packaging recently this year, and this is the rose scented shampoo and conditioner. I really, really, really enjoy these products. Um, it brings me back to being in junior high when they first came out. Um, I remember that nothing smelled like these herbal essence shampoos. They just smelled so good. It lasts all day long. And as a teacher, I am at school working, doing the shows, musicals, everything, you name it. So I don't get home until late. And it's nice that my hair always smells good no matter what. And it keeps me nice and smooth and shiny. So just a great overall product. So glad that these are back and I hope they're here to stay. The next product I really enjoy is the Tresemme Creations and it's the Heat Tamer Leave-In Spray. This is wonderful because I use a lot of heat in my hair, whether it's blow drying my hair, curling it with a flat iron, flat ironing it straight, you name it. I use heat quite a bit and this really helps protect my hair. It's also a drugstore product um, and it's fairly reasonable in price and smells great also and I just feel like it really does a good job with my hair and it keeps it nice and smooth. The next product I really enjoy as well is the Mask of Magnum Minty. This is from Lush. And um, I actually have never tried a Lush product before until this year. I heard about this mask through other YouTube vloggers and I thought, why not? Let's give it a shot. Um, it's cruelty free, which I really appreciate. Um, they are really aware of the environment so you can recycle these. And um, this one in particular, I'll read the description. It says packed full of peppermint, kaolin, and scrubby azuki beans for deeply cleansed skin. And it is awesome. It looks like this. It basically looks like mint chocolate chip ice cream and it smells like mint chocolate chip ice cream. Um, almost to the point where I kind of sometimes want to eat it when I put it on my face, but um, you can't do that. It has some stuff that will not be good for you to ingest, but it makes your skin feel great. It has this nice little minty tingly feeling when you're um, putting it on, which I like because it makes me feel like it's working and it just pulls out all the impurities and leaves your skin feeling so baby smooth. Just really enjoy this product. Definitely going to be repurchasing this. The next product I enjoyed this year is the Fit Me Shine Free Foundation Stick from Maybelline New York. Really enjoy this. This is in the shade 130, which is known as Buff Beige. I really do like this product. It's really easy to apply on, especially for those of you who um, work in the mornings or have a little one like I do. Um, it's just a really easy thing to just swipe on your face, use a foundation brush to just buff it in, and you're ready to go. It does give you a nice matte flawless fi um, finish. It does have that little um, piece there in the center that helps with that matte finish. And I didn't realize how important being matte was until I started seeing pictures of myself and I was like really shiny and it looked like I was just sweating a lot or just greasy so I'm really enjoying being matte and that helps with just a really good powder and also really good foundation um, and this for the price and for being a drugstore product is fabulous. 
Um, going with that, I also really enjoy applying my foundation with a good foundation brush, and this is from Real Techniques by Samantha Chapman. She's also a YouTuber. This is the Expert Face Brush. It's really soft, really nice, and it just feels so good on your skin and really gives you a flawless finish when you're using foundation. So I love it. Um, brushes can be really expensive, and at the price point of 10 bucks, not too shabby. Um, going on to also some more face products, this is from Benefit, and this blush is my favorite. This is the Rockateur blush, and it's a rose gold blush. It's just beautiful. The packaging is really cute and adorable. It has some lace and some rivets on it. Um, if you open it up, it does have a little brush on it. I like to use it. Why not? It comes with the product. Brushes are really expensive, so it's always good to just use the brushes that come for free or with the um, actual product. It smells awesome. It smells like like roses kind of, just like those Benefit products do. And um, the inside, it had a really pretty um, design on it, but obviously I've been using it quite a bit. Um, but beautiful rose gold color, it goes well with any skin tone, just really enjoy it. Um, I also really am liking the Lorac Pro palette. This is a beautiful, beautiful palette that came out um, and it just has every color that you can think of um, that would be good for any skin tone. Again, it has the matte shades up top, and it has the more shimmery shades down at the bottom. I'll show you some swatches here in a minute. Um, but basically, these are just wonderful, wonderful eyeshadows. You can create any look with these. Um, the only downside to it is just the packaging. Um, I don't really like it that much. It feels kind of cheap and flimsy, but other than that, great shadow, great color payoff, very pigmented, um, just buttery on the eyes, love it. Um, some lip products that I'm going to share with you today are the NYX Butter Glosses. Love these. Um, you can find them at your local Target now, which is really nice. And these are really moisturizing. Um, this one is in the shade Tiramisu, which I love. It's just this kind of brown, pinky, nude color. Um, it just really looks beautiful. Love, love, love that shade. And um, just a really good find. They're really sensible, and you can find them at Target, so it's not too expensive and a great nude lip. Then the other um, lip colors that I've been liking, I actually have it on right now, is the MAC Rebel. It's a satin finish and just really pretty purpley plum color for the fall, winter time, holiday season. So really have been enjoying it. I've been really afraid of using dark lips, but I really am starting to enjoy it. I love to line it with my current MAC lip pencil. Um, just a really nice color. Keeps it plummy. Just really, really a good color. Um, the last product that I have is the Plus White um, 5 Minute Premier Whitening System. You can get this at your local drugstore. I got mine at Walmart for about $7. It does come in with a coupon for $1.50 off for your next purchase, so you can actually get it for cheaper if you really enjoy the product. And I really did. I, it comes with three pieces. It has the Speed Whitening Gel, the Stain Guard Rinse, and then the Mouth Guard. And I really have noticed a difference in my teeth, and it's a lot more economical than the Crest Whitening Strips that cost a fortune and are only good for for a couple of weeks so definitely a good investment and I really am happy that I found this and that should finish us off for our 2013 favorite products of the year and my first ever YouTube video thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed what I had to say please give me a thumbs up for this video and don't forget to subscribe please tell your friends and if you have any recommendations of any future videos to do whether it's hauls tutorials or if there's any other products out there that you want me to do a review on please leave a comment down below and don't don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Thank you so much and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!